I'm Holly Silva and I've been a crafts expert for about 15 years now and today I'm going to show you how to make caterpillar projects for kids. I have here a few different pieces of just scratch construction paper. Grab any colors that you'd like. That's one of the coolest thing about making like caterpillars is the colors that you can use for it. That's what makes me most excited about caterpillar projects. So what we're going to do is just start cutting out circles in different shapes of each different color. Now they don't have to be all the same shapes. They don't have to be all the same size. You want them relatively the same size uh, because it is all going to be part of the same body, but they don't have to match, which is the cool thing. While you're cutting these out, you can also make the discussion. You can always also have the discussion on a, you know, a story for the caterpillar. What kind of story does this caterpillar have? What kind of life did it have? What kind of, what kind of butterfly is it going to become once it goes through its cocoon stage? This is a great time for education. There's always a great time for education. It's never a wrong time to be learning or teaching. Well, sometimes teaching, but you know, that depends on the person and the situation, but there's never a wrong time for learning. That is a fact. You learn something new every day, like how to make a caterpillar project. Here we are, see? But for the sake of time, I'm just going to do a couple of, couple, of different, uh, couple of different pieces here. And look, they just fell this way, and look at how cool it is. Now we're going to grab our double stick tape and just a few pieces of each, and stick one here on top of the other overlapping but not completely covering and that piece was a little bit too big so we're gonna shorten it up here there we go and we'll do it like this just take a look at your just take a look at your sizes and see how it might line up you know you don't have to tape it immediately you can take your time and see how it's gonna work out in fact you know what I think I like this blue piece better for a head than I did the brown piece how it fell so we'll do that. We'll make like, you know, just a, like, a little skinny piece of the body. And grab the blue piece. And there it is. Now, it's not a caterpillar, of course, until you have his little smile. Because caterpillars are happy. This little eyeball. Yay, he's happy. And you can even draw little legs on him at the bottom. Caterpillars have a ton of legs. They're not just one leg, but you only have to do it on one side. And that, my friends, is a caterpillar project for kids. Use your imagination. Have a great time. You don't have to use construction paper. You can use tissue paper. You can use anything. Just have a great time with it. We'll see you next time.